When you have a shared mailbox in Microsoft 365, the default behavior is for sent and deleted items to show up in your personal mailbox instead of the shared mailbox's sent and deleted items folders. This is bad design by Microsoft, but it is what it is. So for sent items, you'll need to talk to your IT admin probably. Hopefully they don't take forever to get back to you. So what you'll want them to do is open up PowerShell as administrator. And then they'll need to run the command connect dash exchange online. Import these modules if you haven't already. It'll ask you to sign in. And then the command they want is set dash mailbox mailbox name, for example, finance at test.com. And then with parameter message copy for sent as enabled. And you want to set this to true. And so sent as from the shared mailbox will go to the shared mailbox sent folder. And then similarly, for send on behalf, you just switch this from sent as to send on behalf. So those two commands will fix the sent items issue. And then for deleted items, you can do this yourself. Anybody should have permission. Is you want to create this registry file right here. So what this does is it adds one registry key and this will make it so for all shared mailboxes you have on your account, deleted items will go to the shared mailboxes deleted items instead of personal deleted items. And this applies on a per user basis. So this would be need to be done for each user. So you can either double click this file or you can add the key manually by going to registry editor, and then manually finding this node options, and then creating the general folder, and then adding the new D word 32 bit value. But I'll just double click on the file, click yes to accept the prompt, and then ignore this message, just press yes as per usual, and then press OK. And as you see here, general got added under options, and this key has been added. This will fix the deleted items problem.